on for little beans my name is b and welcome back to my channel before we get started with today's video don't forget to leave a like subscribe and click that bell and of course you stack a b when buying robux or premium i'm happy to say you guys that royal high has just revealed a new summer update that is upcoming and it looks as though people are feeling pretty excited about it as you guys know every time a new season approaches there's one thing we can almost always guarantee is going to happen in royal high no matter how much there seems to lack updates and of course that is the fountain will receive an update every season for a new halo and a new story contest but since barbie has already started working on updates like the one that came out the other day which obviously released the may 2nd update or whatever for some reason the update log is not updated inside the front of campus but as you know the may 2nd update log is available inside the castle's hat obviously they're working on lag fixes which has got a lot of people wondering if this is to prepare ahead for a larger part two summer update maybe something actually substantial coming for summer especially since everyone has been talking about royal high's toy line and things like that that have been previously announced now we're going to talk about all those type of things like the toy line and whatnot in a separate video that you guys can watch i'll probably post that one later on today for you so stay tuned for that but i wanted to talk to you right now about the fact that obviously we know a new update is coming so for those who don't know they announced on their social medias and a video that they said they're posting to youtube that a new tidal glow story contest was beginning which means you guys will have until the end of may to submit stories obviously the rsvps i imagine will be in early may and then the submissions will be for late may which means the update because they always say that the prizes and stuff will be released and the winners announced at the end of the month before the new update comes out obviously that means it would be coming either very late may or the beginning of june so there's a very 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 likely high chance that a new update is going to be coming out right at the beginning of June for us to enjoy which I'm hoping you guys is going to contain more than just the Halo now this time they actually did pretty well obviously the Starlight set came out this time they did a big dorms update they added a bunch of new furniture they added the new options to add multiple dorms it's been nice actually seeing them regularly updating with actual new stuff for us obviously these haven't been like huge huge updates but it's nice to see something substantial with actual content for for us to enjoy now i don't know about you guys but my personal hopes for summer this year for the tidal glow update are hopefully a new set maybe the new school uniform one that fair players has been working on of course many of us are hoping for campus 4 which barbie has already said they're going to aim to try to get out before summer which would be really cool and then we also additionally know that we would really love it if there was going to be something related to a mini game obviously we haven't had any new mini games in a while we know campus 4 has a ton of new ones that's being built out for it we've seen them advertised already barbie has talked about them a lot on her streams so we already do know that a new mini game or several new mini games are going to be coming out for campus 4 but personally i would really 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 enjoy a new update for royal high's summer that has a new mini game too i really 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 honestly you guys miss the beautiful updates they used to release where they used to release like a new seasonal realm and new mini games or even just a reworked version of a previous seasonal realm or something like that it's been so long since we received something like that in royal high and i know that so many people would love it the thing is you guys none of us who care a lot about royal high or used to care about it whether or not you still play it or not or if you just love the game from nostalgic reasons maybe just because you remember how the game used to be whatever it might be that you miss about the game specifically most of us don't necessarily want the game to fail obviously most people would like to see them make the positive changes that we want and make their game thrive again otherwise people wouldn't speak out about issues that they have or they wouldn't try to offer advice or solutions unless they actually wanted to see things do well or go better now the thing is obviously for summer i feel like they have a really good opportunity because summertime is always when obviously kids get off school people are looking 
for games to play. They have a really good opportunity here to essentially just hopefully intrigue a bunch of new players. The thing is, a lot of older players, especially people that played years ago, have aged up now and probably uh, aged out of the game. You know, most people will have probably moved on to other games or are not even playing games anymore and are focusing on real life stuff or getting ready for college and just getting ready for life. And maybe they're not playing games like Royal High anymore. And that's fine. We all move on from stuff as our interests change. But I feel like Royal High is an opportunity here to interest and intrigue a bunch of brand new younger players who are just entering the world of like fashion games and Roblox games and role play and stuff. They could really bring in a ton of new players and revitalize the game and just give it a new lease of life if they really get this update right. If it's just another Halo update, you guys, and some stories, people are not going to be happy about that. I'm not going to be satisfied. We need a set. We need items. We need a mini game. We need like realm changes. We need something to actually properly play. Something that has good replayability too. Just think about Sunset Island. Look at how successful that was. And then say games like Dress to Impress, which have a very similar vibe to Sunset Island. Or games like Fashion Famous that again have a similar vibe. They're all so successful or have been successful in the past because they have loads of replayability. That means people can literally replay the game over and over again and not get bored because each time there's a different outcome, but it's fun to just keep playing it over and over again. Royal High needs more things like that. We've not had anything like that since the beautiful, but admittedly now very old, Campus 3 came out. I mean, Campus 3 is over a year old now, you guys. Well, I mean, obviously, like... If you think about the first time we saw Campus 3, it's actually over like three years old. It's been out for less than a year, but we've seen it in development for much longer than that, which means the campus is actually older than that. We need newer things. We need new things that we can play. For example, the last time we had a mini game that released in the game was actually the Easter mini game, but it's the same mini game we've had many times before. We need brand new things. We need something new to enjoy. We need something that can revitalize our interest and excite us again for Royal High. And I really feel like a mini game for summer would be perfect. I mean, you guys, I have so many ideas. They could literally just do something simple like Poppy has lost all of the dorm keys help her to locate them across the school campus or they could be like the student ID cards have gone missing or everybody's student ID cards have broken help Poppy to print new ones there's so many little things and quests that they could do personally I would love if they bring back NPC quests I mean they've got these guards why not have these guards have quests for us to do give each one a quest that happens around the school for us to do that would be the perfect thing for summer they could even leave them in the game and not remove it after summer's done so people kind of like in diamond beach can go back and play it later it would be perfect for new players i really just hope they're going to consider all of these things and to write these amazing storylines and lore and these fun quests and these fun mini games and add that replayability that we've been missing from royal high for such a long time now i think it will be really good personally you guys i think they should get the crimmers crew who made all the seasonal updates in 2021 like Callan and stuff and get them all together and get them to develop these updates because they did such a good job in 2021 of making regular amazing updates and I think it would be really good if they could come back and do the same thing again it would be absolutely perfect you guys and I would love that so much oh the capture Honestly, guys, though, I am very much open to hear your opinions and your thoughts too. I know all of you will have a different idea of what you would like to see for summer. So please do let me know in the comments down below. But I forgot to actually show you guys the thread that I was going to mention. So in case you guys wanted some information about what is actually coming already confirmed. As you guys can see, they shared on threads and I believe tweeted as well and said, heads up, the next story contest will be opening very soon. Details will be posted on our YouTube channel shortly and we will repost it here too. We're really excited to see your stories this time especially since it was part of one of our longest seasons. As you guys know, Tidal Glow is one of the longest seasons. I mean, the summer fantasy set just went on sale. Did you guys see how long it's on sale for? If we go and have a look for the summer fantasy set, you can see 121 days, you guys. This is a very long season, much, much longer than many of the others. So there's an opportunity here to really make it good. And I just hope they take the opportunity, you guys, and don't waste it. I know everyone's talking about this new toy line and stuff and that taking up their time, but if they don't have 
a solid player base then nobody's going to buy the toys they have to focus both on the game and the development and the mini games and the exciting things that we all crave in order to get people to be interested in stuff like that as well so i definitely think it would be nice to see some positive things coming for summer so what do you guys think let me know in the comments down below i am really nervous about summer i just really hope they nail it because it's been a while since we've had such a solid good update i mean in my opinion the best summer update they can do would be release the rest of campus 3 get the cafeteria out get the art class out maybe get the gymnasium that we saw out like get some of the things that are meant to be in campus 3 released that would be one of the best things they could do and maybe another one of those temporary classes kind of like the easter game maybe they need more developers to help focus on these things too so we can have more than just one thing happening in each update because yes that worked back in the day in say 2020 or 2018 and earlier that obviously those early updates it was easy to just release just something basic but we got used to 2021 where the updates were really in depth like all those quests that we had in new years and all the quests on diamond beach we need something with lots of options more than one quest more than one mini game something to really pique our interest and hold us in the game and keep us interested for a long time and i'd be very intrigued to hear what you guys think about all of this so let me know in the comments down below thank you so much for watching i love you all lots join my discord if you haven't already and share your opinions with us in there we are doing daily raw high giveaways on my discord server right now you guys from halos to sets diamonds various rare items all sorts of stuff so make sure you join if you haven't already so you can enter those giveaways thanks so much for watching i'll see you all live on twitch remember we have our weekly halo giveaway so when you're watching this video that is today we'll be live on my twitch at 3 p.m eastern and we announce the halo winner at 4 p.m so make sure you come on by and then as soon as the winner is announced we announce the next giveaway for the next halo so again make sure you come on by otherwise you'll miss out on a free halo you might as well enter them you never know different people have won every single week so far so lots of people getting blessed with brand new halos all right you guys we'll see you soon have a great day bye bye be sure to join my Discord server. You can participate in massive giveaways, join in with our giant pageant events with huge prizes, quiz nights and other events, meet and greets where you can actually talk to me, trade with other members, share your concepts, share your fan art, share your outfit looks and dorm design, get the latest news for games like Royal High, Dress to Impress and more. Plus you can share your creations like YouTube videos, TikToks or commissions and even join my Minecraft server to play with me or even talk about other games if you're not feeling really Robloxy today and even find the perfect decal codes for your outfits and dorm furniture. There's so much more to find in my discord server so click the link in the description down below and come and join us.